Okay, let's go on. So we were doing, we were preparing the frame, this frame. So I, I, I selected this and then in vertex selection and then delete this. But now look, this is the size of the layer and this is my real object size. So I want the layer to be the same size of the object. To do this, what I'm going to do is to select again the black and then ask to crop everything but the image. So crop the selection. Now this is the layer size. Good. Now Now I have to, okay, I'm going to select everything. So now what I want to, what I want to do is to, uh, to place this and copy in a sequence. But first I have to calculate how big it has to be so that I have the, same, the, the right size for all the figures that I want to have, okay? So what I'm going to do is to divide, to divide the, the length by the number of figures that they want to do. I want to have uh, eight pictures, then because it is 3,300 divided by eight, sorry, divided by seven, it is 470. And here in this direction, I want uh, five, that is 2340 divided by 5, it is 400, uh, 468. So what is almost 470. So what I'm going to do finally is to scale this, to scale this to 470 times 470 or 468. So I'm going to scale the layer to 468 and 468. I think it's 470 this size. Let's do it. Let's do the same. 468 or 468. Sorry. This is my new size. And now what I have to do is to move it and duplicate it. So I'm gonna place it here and then duplicate it. You know how to duplicate it? Yes, you know, right? Now I have duplicated it and I get it here. I put together. To be sure that you put it together, better if you get closer. Okay, and then you move it, place it together. Good. Now duplicate again and move to the next. Now duplicate again. move to the next. You have to be very sure that you do it straight. And duplicate again. And duplicate again. We could do it faster. Later we are going to do it faster. You want to learn. But now I'm doing step by step so that you can see that. Okay. Duplicate again. And I think 